we all need to learn how to take care of our earth and if we don't, global warming can have like a serious impact on us. People think that we can't change this earth since like so many people don't care, but if we give it that attitude, then no one will care. If we be together and do things together, maybe like we'll be stronger that we can like, you know, stop it. Like the next generation and like if we don't help our planet and do all this, there won't be a planet to come to. This particular program is, like in the title, a Youth Green Action Plan. And so the idea is to start to involve youth of various backgrounds in climate justice and what it means to take climate action. We're one of many sites that are doing these workshops and at the end we want all the leaders to come together and come up with an intervention or an action that they can do themselves in their neighborhood, either in a group or just alone, to help this global issue? What can they do to help others want to help? One of the important strands of this project was ensuring that the leaders know about the Indigenous ways of knowing, being, and feeling, as well as acknowledge the land that we're on. By the end of these five weeks, hopefully, they will be choosing an action to take within their community that is climate justice related and will yeah, really bring something to the community. The big picture is inspiring these young leaders to go out and make changes and showing them that even though they are one individual, they do have the power to inspire others around them and that their actions create a ripple effect on the people around them and to show them that they do have power. Uh, today we're explaining uh, the things we can do for Mother Earth. People here haven't been treating Mother Earth as well for a very long time. So here in Green Action, they have a group of kids who make ideas for how to change how we treat Earth today. I honestly think that we should like go back to like teepees and not buildings because buildings are ruining the earth and stuff. We're looking to get more composting, like a glass disposal so that glass isn't always on the ground. I would pick up glass and I would use gloves. Glass is very dangerous. Less pollution nation, if that's a word, I don't know, but less of that. The needs will be um, um, to stop having all these gas-powered vehicles and change them all to hybrid or electric. More people out of the streets and having new homes like shelters and stuff picking out what's recycling and garbage because those are the two basic easiest steps that people mostly use to overlook. I feel like at our age, um, most people don't really think that we can make a change. As like the next generation, I feel like we should be able to know how to take care of our planet especially since we're living on it. As soon as Green Action Plan talks to everyone, at kids like us and adults, how to change the environment, we start to become more aware. The government and city councilors will maybe start listening to how we should change the environment. Definitely helping the community. It's been one of my very like strong things I really wanted to do. Myself, outside of club, I see a lot of people littered, and it's like, it's not right. Projects like this are important to the youth in the community because we're all working together and it's, it can't be a community if we don't have the collaborative projects because that's, that's what it's all about, is working together. Projects like this and communities like this can actually do something. It's important for these types of programs because the leaders have been exposed to a lot that they wouldn't be exposed to otherwise. So I'm from Kenya, which is really far away, and I'm really happy to have this opportunity. I realize and recognize that climate change is a global issue, so I'm glad to be able to be studying in Canada as well as making a difference. Maybe as soon as us people tell the government high city officials how we should change our environment, maybe this area would be a lot different. I just think it's a good plan overall, and we're actually making a lot of progress. The collaboration between the communities and between these young leaders will help them grow and continue to make a change in their communities. 
stop climate change.